I am working on a classical biological control project of puncture vine. Uh, puncture vine is a weed that is a problem in both agricultural areas and yeah. in suburban and urban areas uh, throughout the western United States. And um, so there are some classical biological control agents or insects from puncture vines native range that feed on the weed and reduce its spread. Um, so these are tiny weevils. We have lots of, of these weevils in southern New Mexico and uh, we have been looking at whether these weevils are suitable for um, use in colder climates. And so the question is, why do we have more weevils in southern New Mexico than we see in other places where there are puncture vine and where the weevils have been introduced? And so one hypothesis is because the weevils just aren't very cold hardy. And so they just, they can survive in the summer, but then in the winter they die. And so there's, each year the population has to build back up. But some other uh, hypotheses are that we just have, the weevils are able to build up here in southern New Mexico for a longer period of time. We have more favorable weather and we have multiple generations of the weevil here uh, whereas in Colorado and northern places there's only one generation per year and so the population is limited by that. We're testing the cold tolerance of these weevils using some overwintering cages outside this year and also doing some lab studies to test their ability to withstand cold temperatures. So the overwintering trials involve um, we collected weevils from three separate locations here in southern New Mexico in Las Cruces uh, we collected some in northern New Mexico at a research station in Farmington, New Mexico, and then we collected a third set of weevils from Palisade, Colorado, which is in western Colorado. We installed these big six by six foot outdoor cages, and we um, each of these cages has 21 potted plants with 10 weevils each from one of the three locations I described. So every month the way that we'll um, collect data for this experiment is every month we'll go collect uh, one of these potted plants from each of the big walk-in cages from every location um, and then we'll open up the cages and we will count the number of live weevils and dead weevils and so the idea is that we are testing to see whether the weevils from more northern locations like Palisade or Farmington will survive better in those locations. The idea is that if these weevils from southern New Mexico are just as good at overwintering in Colorado as they are here that we could we could introduce New Mexico weevils to more northern climates and provide sort of a boost to their population and, and that would help their populations build up faster in the summer and um, be a more effective biocontrol agent.